Welcome back, guys. I've been not feeling the greatest the last couple of days, but we are rolling, and we have a lot to do. Uh, today, we're going to be doing, obviously, Minecraft, and tomorrow, we have a cool event coming out for ARK that we're going to be taking a look at the 4th of July stuff, finally. And, but today, we got so much to do on here, so let's get rolling here, and we got... Let's get our Pui armor on. If you notice, I lost a lot of levels. Here, let's grab the stick. Uh, I've actually been online a few times since the last episode working on stuff. Uh, we went to the nether, and as you can see, like I had mentioned, my levels are gone. We may have had an incident in stream where I may or may not have died, but we're not going to get into it. That was my first server uh, death, obviously, but... Uh, Anywho, we got this here, and it's getting kind of ugly. So one of the things I wanted to do is I was standing back looking at this earlier, and that looks like we could turn that into a cactus. But in order to do that, we need to, well, first get this ladder off the side. There we go. Um, we're, we're not going to work on that today, but we need to get started so we can do that. We need to get our base eventually going too, um, but what we're going to do to get a, that to look like a cactus is we are going to come over here and we are going to start breeding these things and we're going to eventually, once we get done breeding them, as you can see, I've already been breeding them this morning. Oh, get over here. And there you go. And we're going to actually do this to here because right now beef is actually my main source of food so we're gonna do this too there we go and uh we're what we're gonna use is we're gonna use wool on that build um and so we definitely need to get these guys going and then eventually we're gonna paint them um, we'll have some black ones we'll have some lime ones and we'll dye the sheep so they're a certain color but we have some more pressing issues so i went to go start getting all my stuff to build our new base and i ran across this <laughs> uh i kind of got my own little chest monster started and we need to sort out our chest really badly although i did off camera too uh craft up all our redstone so we can start doing redstone builds now and I am super pumped about that. So what I'm gonna actually going to do, guys, and I know this sounds crazy, but I need to start by sorting out all my chests because we're not going to be able to do anything if uh, my chests aren't sorted. Uh, so I will be our bees. Holy crap, we're back. Uh, this definitely took a while. Um... So, we have some plant stuff here, miscellaneous here, it's the kind of stuff that doesn't really go in another chest, and our dump chest. So what this is, is when I go out and do something, if I'm in a hurry, I can just throw a bunch of stuff in here, sort it out later. Then we got dirt, gravel, and sand, and normally, this wouldn't be, this would be separated out into a bunch of chests, but because of the new generation, it seems like we can get all this stuff in here. And not only that, but we're going to be using a lot of concrete this year, so I don't think we're going to have this super stocked up at any point. Our stone chest, the ites, the granite, diorite, and andesite, amethyst stuff, which actually we're doing pretty good on. I should have called that geode stuff, I guess. Oh, well, not a big deal. Random blocks. Mob drops, which is this and animal. Mobs, like passive mobs and stuff for normal mobs. So uh, we're going to be putting the horse armor in there. In fact, we will be getting armor. Actually, I'm going to leave that in there now. But we're going to be getting a horse today because our world is so flat. We'll get into it more later, but it would be really nice to have that and go old school. Either a redstone box, 
Building box, food box, wood box, kind of wood, wood and wood products, another stuff, and deep slate, which this we're saving up because I think our base is going to be built out of deep slate, probably these bricks, and maybe calcite, we'll see, that's a, calcite's not easy to get, but it is really cool looking. And I think that's all of it. Oh, we got our ores up here uh, and sorted out. So if you guys are wondering why I do this, uh, this stuff. So for example, I'll put, I'll pre put stuff out. So let's just say we had all of this, like this here in our inventory. <clears throat> the reason I kind of like take up all the spaces is so I can just go like this and it sorts itself out. So. Otherwise, you just end up with a super messy chest. Um, actually, though, and we got... Karina's been playing like a mad woman. And uh, here we go. Here, Dave. And no spying on Kelly's window. Kelly Hale is my wife. She's playing on the server. She's actually that house over the hill over there. Um, but we get to play with some of the new stuff. So... Um, I'm not sure why them are in there. I did bring these over because I did have these from, I believe I got them from a shipwreck. But these slime blocks are really going to help us out But in this name tag. Um, I'm not why, sure why the raw pork chops are in there. I may have used this as a, as a dump chest at some point really quickly. Um, but ch check out this spyglass, guys. Um, let's see. Let's see how well it works at a distance. That I'm just so pumped about the spyglass. I know it's something dumb, but actually, do we look like... Uh, let's get into our other view here. Um, so, I kind of... I wish you could get like a side view of it. <laughs> It doesn't zoom in when on bedrock like this. So on PlayStation, when you like, or on on PC when you're like this, it'll zoom in your whole view, even though you're not like looking through it. You're just putting it up to your face. But anyway, I know not everybody's excited about this thing, but I kind of am. Um, it'll help, especially if uh, not so much on. I guess as much on bedrock. Um, but it is really cool, and I really like the idea of it. Just like the dark glass, which we're not going to get into yet, but let's go ahead. Actually, I want to put, before I mess this up, maybe we should put some of the stuff away here. I don't want to lose it or have it get blown up by a creeper. But we'll put this in our nether. I can't wait, because... As you guys know, these, the warped trees, the, the, I think I guess it's called the warped, uh, fungus stuff is really cool. Uh, and I really like building out of it. Okay, so let's get, we'll put these in here for right now. Gear and tools. It is nice to have, uh, the base sorted out. Um, that's going to help us immensely here in slime. I think we're going to put these slime blocks in the redstone box. Just because and that's what I would generally use them for. And we can do a miscellaneous for the name tag. These sides can go in here for right now along with that. So we're actually set up really good. But the one thing I really wanted to show you guys... Um, Let's grab some bone meal. I think this will be enough, but let's grab this just to be in case. Um, let's go. I kind of want to leave some of this for Rex. So let's go over to Rex's house. I'm sure he'll be on at some point today. And we'll do a little bit of a deal. Let's do... Oh, like so, and we're kind of going to not only be nice and give him some of this, but we're going to prank him as well. Oh, I 
right, so that's obviously there. Can we get keep going? I don't want to turn this house into it, but oh wow. Holy cow, that is so cool. So if you guys didn't know, this is the new block. And I think, oh, I can't do it. Oh, I thought you could sink into her. But uh, we're going to make him a little greenhouse paradise over here as well. Oh, there we go. Let's go ahead and do that. <laughs> I, uh... So if you guys didn't know, these are called, here, give me a second, what's that called? Flowered azalea leaves. I really like these trees, and what is that called here? I'm sure it's a flowered, flowering azalea, yeah. Um, I think they're absolutely cool, and this is going to give us a lot more stuff to do. I know it sounds crazy, but I've been really wanting to um, get into better building. I'm not the greatest of builders. You know, oh, come on. Oh, it's a dumb thing. It's okay. No wonder I couldn't do it. And let's do the whole front of Rex's house that way. <laughs> oh, I think that's kind of cool. <laughs> you have a little surprise when he gets on, actually. But we're going to go over. I think I'm going to make a cut. I'm going to grab my saddle, too. Um... Wait, was that a horse? I thought I no, that was that was uh, a ship. But I'm gonna go grab it too, cause I'm gonna try to get a horse today, as well. But I think we're gonna go over to Wix's house and get her back for uh, her little prank last time, if you guys don't remember. But uh, she pranked us in the last episode. We're gonna get her back. She had sign and some other stuff. But anyway, I'm going to clean up, um, grab my saddle and stuff and armor, and we're going to go try to get a horse today, guys. Okay, as you guys know, Wix pranked me in the last episode of her deal, and she had just a little dirt mound house that I was going to come over here and prank, but this is not the dirt mound house I expected. Uh, hopefully she's got an episode coming out because this looks cool and she's done a ton. Even her own little fishing pond over here. That's crazy. She's been doing a ton of work. But that doesn't mean we still aren't going to prank her because um, I obviously need to get revenge. Uh, not that this is going to be revenge, and she's going to have the new bot moss block, so I don't think she's going to be real mad, obviously, but I do, oh, I do want to get her back for sure, so we're going to try to do a bunch of her front yard and uh, mossy stuff and things here, Yeah, let's go here, I noticed... So if you guys don't know, what you do to make more of this is you have to bone meal a moss block that you find in a chest a lot of times on a ship. And uh, you have to bone meal it, which is very interesting. And it it's easy to break, so it's like, bam, you know, it's like really easy to break. Now let's go ahead and put that in there. Um, but this stuff is super cool. I, I really like it. And... If a person wanted to do cheap mining, you could do that as well, because it actually will replace cobblestone. Um, so let's take a look at what her front yard is going to look like now. Um, let's get a little bit up here. I think she's missing that. Let's go ahead. Can we... Yeah, get one of them going. Maybe one more over yonder. If it'll let me... What the heck? Come on, you could grow. Okay, what about you? You can grow, right? Thank you. Them trees are kind of neat. I really like them. And let's go ahead and give her some more over here. But I am super pumped about this. These new blocks. Because it definitely is going to make making decorating look a lot cooler. Let's see what our house looks like now. Wix, you might want to mow your front yard. And uh, 
I don't know if she didn't think I didn't watch her videos, but she has the coordinates in her videos, so that's how I found her place, obviously. Oh, speaking of that, where is she on the map? Oh, she's way up in the top, okay. See, our base is actually down that way over there. But it is really cool, so not to be a snooper snooper ten, but I did, and because I wanted to see how cool her house was. Wix has already got, she's been out here one episode, she's already got three mending books. That's crazy. That's just insane. So we need to end the episode by finding a horse zone. We gotta, I'm going to try to find a good one here, guys. Because uh, this walk is basically a flat shot to my house. Uh, but we need, a, uh, we need a horse to make this quicker and I don't burn up all my food. So... Okay, we're back. I did grab a horse over there. Um, it, uh, not a lot of health. It's not terrible on speed, but I can tell you guys, it is a terrible jumper. Uh, for example, like, even to jump one block into here. Oh, let me get on a side where there isn't a block to help me, but... It will not even jump into here, which is pretty, pretty insane. We're going to jump in, though. It did, however, have a baby. Um, we are going to actually, oop. We're going to take the saddle off for the time being. And we're going to kind of hope the baby is a little bit better. But at least we got a horse. And it isn't slow, slow by any means. Um, we're going to name it, but we're going to see if that baby is quicker in the upcoming episodes here. Um, but it is white, so it's really cool. I like when they're all white or pretty much all black. It doesn't really matter to me, but because of the area we live in, and if you look at the map, all this is really flat and connected where we live. Really want to do the horse stuff. Uh... I, uh, I'm a big fan of not using elytras when I can. Oh, I need to clean this up. Um, but anyway, guys, that's going to be the end of the episode here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. And uh, we need to keep making progress. We'll see you next time, folks. <laughs>